Delta variant now the dominant strain of COVID-19 in Illinois. That's according to Reditus Labs in Pekin. Reditus saying they randomly tested 367 samples from people who were COVID positive in July, and 95% of them were the Delta variant. Two weeks before, a sequencing run only turned up 64 Delta cases. Of the 347 new cases, 23 were from Peoria, 30 in the Twin Cities area, 100 came from the Metro East St. Louis area. And as that Delta variant fuels a new, uh, fuels a new surge of the virus, the U.S. hits the president's vaccine goal a month late. 70% of American adults now have at least one shot. The goal was to reach that by July 4th. The U.S. has marked five straight days of getting over 700,000 shots into arms, but that's still far from peak levels. And the CDC says one person sick with the Delta variant can infect five unvaccinated people, twice as many as the original strain of the virus. The president expected to speak about the pandemic tomorrow. We're not going back to the shutdowns of March of 2020. Uh, we're not going back to the economy shutting down. We've made too much progress. Right now, five states account for nearly half of all new COVID-19 cases. One of them is our neighbor, Missouri. In Florida, the governor there announcing there will be no new restrictions or mandates. While New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio urging New Yorkers to wear masks inside, but stopped short of issuing a new mandate.